Hello everyone and welcome back to another Trainton World 4 video. I said I'd do it and we've done it. We're going to be doing a video in the class 314 and it's also a 6 coach class 314. Um, so let's um, let's get everything set up and ready to go. Uh, so we are on the updated Cathcart circle. So you've got 385s, 380s, um, etc. around us. Um, DSD and AWS. And also, Five Circle wasn't installed um, in the first look, but it only adds two services, uh, and they don't even, they don't come to Glasgow Central. It's just a depot movement. That's it. Um, right, doors open. Uh, we've already got the green, so that's fine. I got master key. Okay, that should be doing that. Uh, we'll set you to being headlights and marker lights. Destination board light on. Um, yeah, we should be all good. I sort of want. I want to do an evening service on here. Oh, that's yeah, that's funny. Why do they do that? Oh, far oh, away. Can't see it. Oh, close to it. It's back. That's bizarre. That might actually be something to do with TOD four. I don't know. Oh, that's no, fine now. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well. Oh well. Yeah, we've six coaches. We've got the three, well, three, you know, three coaches each, uh, and then we've also nicely got. This is from Creators Club. Uh, our mod, mod Pete's um, SPT um, Carmen and Cream livery, I think it's called. Um, so that's quite cool. Again, this is from Creators Club. Look at that. We've got so many trains there. We've got 385 here, I think. Is it 385. I think that's a 385 there. 318 and 314 here. I mean, we ideally we shouldn't really see a 314 here, um, as 314's got retired in 2019. But it's still cool. Right, um, door shut. We're going to be calling at Product Shores East, Queens Park, Cross Hill, Mount Florida, Cathcart, Muir, and William Works of all stops to Nilston. Right. Oh, they're already released. Okay, off we go. Six coaches. Oh, and you can use this now as well. Can, what do we have? Can we? Where's the head code? Do we not get the head code? Oh, there we go. Yeah, that now works as well. So you can also, well, click the GSMR button. Oh, there's that one there with the cream at the back. Nice. Right, out of uh, Glasgow Central we go. I don't know how many six coach services there are, but I saw it in the last video we did where we went via Pollock Shields West, and it was like, we got to do that. So we're doing that exact service we saw. There's the 380. Let's get a, um, a screenshot here, why not? Well, why is it going all blurry, the Nilston thing again? It's so weird. Not sure why it does that, but hey ho. What can we do, eh? Uh, let's try and get a nice shot of it. Mm, yeah. There we, there we go. So many trains, there's another one behind that ready to go in. The 385 there. Proper busy. So this is sort of be pre rush hour. So I sort of getting the train ready for the masses of people coming down from Nilston. Yeah, 2 November 06. Shut that off. Got my cup of tea with me as well, very important. There's that weird sound of the 385. Yeah, Cathcart Circle is now a TOD4. You may have already seen us do a 314 video. Not completely certain yet as of recording this one. Um, but I'm, I'm recording this on Monday and Dovetail might be releasing the Kafka update tomorrow but I don't think 
you get the new timetable with the TOD4 update. I think you have to have the 380 to then get the new timetable. So we're doing this video nonetheless. even have two 314 videos. Maybe. And I'm pretty certain it's 25 here. I don't know if there's a speedball for it though. It doesn't really make much of a difference though. But it's just cool being able to do six coaches on here. I don't know if there's any 380 services where you can do two slash zeros together. I'm assuming there probably is. So we'll have to do that at some point as well. Do a double 380. Double services are just cool. There's on the old timetable for this uh, route. It was literally, it was just all three coaches. There was no six coach services. Um, whereas in real life, they did run. They well, they 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 do run six coach services. So to sort of be able to do this is is great. That was sort of another sort of boring thing about the old Cathcart timetable. Everything was just the same. It was always a three on four, and it was always just a free coach. That that was it. So we got a bit more excitement now. Uh, coming into Pollock Shields East. Should be right down to the end of the platform here. Yeah. That's a bit weird having just driven the 380 to now coming to here and uh, doing the 314. need to get used to sort of the brakes again on here. Yeah, that'll do it. And right side door release. And all coaches do have to fit on the platform. This just doesn't have SDO. Yeah, so you wouldn't be able to sort of shut, you know, some doors. That has to, they all have to fit on. Lovely, 20 seconds. Actually, we'll get the door shut now. Let's watch it departing. Oh, on that bench here, you can sit on that bench. Right, then that's the one you can um, yeah sit on. If you want to watch the trains on the junction. And this is Queen's Park coming up. And again, right to the end. It's quite handy just knowing it will be right to the end of the platform. Well, they're saying that. That's not completely right to the end. I mean, almost, but not completely. Well, the one perk of this train over the 380 is once you get down to a low speed, it literally will just glide. Um, whereas in the 380, it you know you get below three miles an hour, it's just like right, I'm stopping now. That's it. That's enough. 
Right, door's shut. Next stop is Cross Hill. And let's go. Oh, he's just missed the train. He's like, no, wait up. Sorry, mate. Have a tea. Now you might have been seeing this train and thinking, hang on, that looks very similar to another train in the game. Yeah, we've also got the class 313 uh, for East Coast Road, which basically uses the exact same audio and everything as this train. So we do, if you, yeah, you, you probably you might have driven this train before, well, 313, which is not a lot different. Pretty nice stuff, actually. Yeah, not bad. There's a 380 down the down. Why is it going down the end? Is that a four coach? What's it doing? Yeah, it's only a yeah, only a three coach, but it's gone right down to the end. Oh, hang on. Unless the no, look, there's the marker. There. What's it doing down there? Driver's overshot. And Mount Florida next. I'm actually, I'm, I'm, I think, I think this train is weird, weird to say, as it's an older train, but I think this train is actually easier to drive than the 380. No, no. I just like having the brake and the throttle separate, and also the fact you can sort of glide it in without sort of being like, oh, we're going to stop here instead. It's better at coasting to a stop. Nilston on here. And Mount Florida's just around the corner. And then Cathcart, and then we're out on the Nilston branch after that. Quite a nice stop, actually, or is it? No, a little bit of step two. Back to step one. Look at that, that was, that was gentle. Straight on the marker as well. This is Mount Florida. Those are the rules already. We've already got the uh, signal there. With a position four junction indicator. But it is nice the way this train's well being upgraded as well. Um, TOD four now. So that's what, well, they wouldn't have. But imagine if they had just left the train. All the lighting would have been weird, and yeah. So I like the way they've actually done something to it. 
And I suppose it is nice that they have included it within the sort of Class 380 modern timetable, even though they got retired in 2019, which is sort of a bit like, uh, it's a bit weird. But I doubt the timetables will be changing much. Um, so. They've also um, up, um, updated the overhead catenary as well. It looks a lot better than you know what it did originally on this route. It was extremely basic before. A very basic go hey chili. I can't remember if you even had the uh, no. You, you did have the um, um, catenary wire. Yeah, you must have. Is Cathcart. We have got the um, stop marker on the left hand side, which makes things a lot easier. And the end there for Nilston. Really nice stop. Right, here we are. This is Cathcart. The namesake of the route. <laughs> so we're, we're a minute late, so we're definitely holding up another train. Somewhere. Right, Muir End. Let's go. I was I always originally thought these trains had guards on them, but I don't think they do. Hence the um, CCTV screens on the platforms. Yeah, I think these were D O O. Driver only operated. per hour and Muir End's not that far and it says it's 50 all the way to Patterton or after Patterton but then goes up to 55 for the last little sprint over to uh, Nilston cool a little bit of speed on us yeah, I like in the ballast colour. I remember when people used to mention it, I'd be like, really? The ballast colour? But it does make a big difference. Um, you know, if you look at sort of real life Scottish routes, they do, it does have that sort of orangey red ballast colour. Nature that, you know, England, the Midlands, it's sort of a brownie colour. Um, it does, yeah, it does make quite a big difference to sort of the aesthetics of the, of the route. Coach there. Cool. Oh, it's quite cool um, gameplay packs I see at some point. Um, a bit like the Centro 323. Maybe they could um, officially recreate the um, yeah the cream and red livery, the SPT livery. Because the downside to having it on a Creators Club uh, livery is the fact the unit number is always the same. So it would actually be quite cool if they could do it as an official, you know, livery DLC. I know not everybody's a big fan of that, but I like it because it just makes it more realistic.
external action for you. first pit we got in the game. I think this actually got announced after the class 3 on 3 got announced. As I think the class 3 on 3 just kept getting pushed back and back and back. So the 3 on 3 actually was on the roadmap to begin with. And then the Glasgow Kafka Circle appeared. As this was the first pet we actually got in the game was here, yeah, the 3 on 4. Probably only barely just fit in here. And we're not even going to the end either. That's just quite quite a snug fit. Okay, well let's have a look. Are we how are we doing? Look at that, only just about. Wow, there's a bit of leeway. Little bit of leeway. Right. Door shut. Uh, next station stop will be White Craigs. Where the UFO is. I don't have it ticked, so we won't see it. Which is the mastery. I don't know why the destination's blurry. Well, I think that actually might have been an issue pre update as well. I don't know. I don't feel that can be sorted. First route to have a UK train using OHLE as well. Or first AC electric train. And sort of the first proper time we had seen overhead catenary for UK stuff. I mean, we did have it on Great Western Express, but it wasn't like it didn't, it didn't work. Or you could sort of drive an AC electric train. And uh, White Craig's is just round here. You just sort of swing round to the right. The station's sort of just there. There it is. Platform. It's been a really enjoyable run though. It's just good to be back in the 314 and to see it, you know, TOD4. Updated, looking good, looking bright. And six coaches, which is sort of the main sort of cool thing. 
the wow factor. So yeah, this is White Craig's. Another nice stop. All of our stops, I think, have been quite, quite nice. Maybe apart from Pollock Shields East. Yeah, let's go. Next up is Patterson. Which always reminds me, every single time I say Patterson, it just reminds me of um, <laughs> General uh, Patton in uh, in the Second World War. Patterson Station. Patton. Patterson. Well, away we go. Patterson's not too far. And after that, you took the long stretch out to Nilston. One. Yeah, hopefully everyone has enjoyed the flurry of um, Kafka content. There'll be plenty more to come. Um, this will probably be going out on launch day of the 380. Um, but I just thought we'd sort of revisit the. Um, well, that's a six coach stop marker, but that's for the 380, that six coach stop marker. So I'll go down to the end. Um, yeah, I thought we'd sort of revisit the 314, because I know a lot of you probably will probably be getting this route for the 380 um, so I thought we'd sort of come back and just do a video of the update uh, for Kafkar and show you the 314 probably could have come in a bit quicker that's so slow that would do but yeah, I, could, I probably could have stopped on the um, 6 coach mark but it was the 380 6 coach marker not, in, not 314 no 380 I don't think there was a six coach for the uh, 314. Right, let's get the door shut. And next up is Nilston. Hang on, if I put it into off, oh, yeah. Now we can go. Hopefully, there. Uh, Let's pretend we're the guard, even though these are, were DOO. Look at that. Cool. Although one thing with the 380 and this train, there's no suspension to them still. I don't know why that's taken so long to do the suspension. Well, we got it on the 218 on main tail barn. Got it on the pacer. It's coming to the other trains within the Blackpool uh, branches, so the 47 and the 08. I don't get why it's taken. Like, the suspension update, I think, was meant to be a train sim world 4 sort of launch thing. But it sort of just hasn't happened. Well, I mean, it has obviously on the pace it, but for the other trains. Which is a bit like, uh, what's going on? So I think the next train to get the suspension is the 66. 
Which just does make sense as it does go on to basically every single route. It's really quite a cool one to have with uh, suspension. Now it's a 55. I think there's a 40 before in Elston. Down before it. Oh, which will get that up. New Lion Cross Station, or the proposed Lion Cross Station. And I think someone mentioned they're now building another station somewhere along here now. Like a new housing development. Speed a lot more in the three on four as opposed to the three eighty. Let's get a fly by shot. I haven't really got one, have we? Yeah, this would be like the most rural part of the route. And Nilston is sort of a little bit out of Glasgow. Well, the line actually used to continue past Nilston. I can't remember where it went. I remember having a look on Google Maps when... Um, what's the kind of platform there? When um, Talfcart first came out. Used to continue and join up with another sort of active main line. That's like there's hardly any signals on this uh, part of the road. Hardly any. I suppose there's not really any need to have many. Hardly any trains along it. Not every half hour. There's a 380. Now we're now coming into Nilston. That was a 40, unless maybe that's coming into this platform, but then you should really be at a lower speed than that anyway. But maybe not. Maybe they used to be. Should hopefully have the position light signal. Do we have it? No, we don't have the position light signal, not yet. to the end which makes a nice difference in crawling into stations you've got to stop sort of halfway up now this is Nilston I've put that on and it will change no not yet so you've got to use there's no um Thing is to get across here, no crossover, so you've got to go into the turn back side and then get onto the um, onto the up line. And yeah, I think we got to, and we got to close. Right, let's close the doors. It might then flick the um, signal. Sorry, 
Actually, I think it counts as a uh, yeah, it counts as yeah, a separate service still. Don't really know why, but is that Newton doesn't count as a separate one. Went until 7.29. This would then form the next one back to, uh, to Glasgow. Short and long stay still on the train. Should be off. So we should get the road shortly. Should do. Wait for a moment. Why, why do we have to wait a minute? Wait for a moment. It's been a moment. Signal, stop playing games. No route available. About 40 seconds, then we can then go into the turn back side. And GSMR's already given up. Although, saying that, uh, we'll actually turn it back on because we'll now have a different head code. We should be a five certified, a class five service. Yeah, 5 November 11. So we'll do that. There you go, 5 November 11. Still can't register what the signal is ahead of us, which would be, I suppose, 044. Right. Yeah, it should get the position light signal. There we go. So we can take it into the uh, turn back side. As we slowly come in, we're going to obviously right down to the end. As we are six coaches, so we do need to sort of make sure we are clear of the uh, uh, signal. And we know good change on ends and being like, oh, we're not even past the signal. So you'd have to, well, it would be a bit, being a bit of a pickle. So right down to the end. Definitely a bit more foliage over the place, which is nice. Like to see it. Roll in, there we go. Like me counted as stop in there, okay. There we go. Uh, return to free roam, do that. So that sort of that is the end of the service now. Um, but yeah, that is going to be it from me. Hopefully everybody has enjoyed it. Uh, that was a run from um, well, from Glasgow Central to Nilston. Uh, links can be found in all the usual places: Discord, PayPal, merch store. Uh, that was the updated 314 and Glasgow Cathcart Circle with the 380 on it and the new timetable as well. Um, see you all. Take care. Bye guys. Thank you.